Hi and welcome to this video. You are looking for a solution to add a date picker to your product or you want to allow your customers to choose a delivery time or a store pickup time, then Dato Date Picker is the perfect solution for your demand. So I have I've already opened up here my product page on my Shopify store and you can see I have here a flower box and now I want to add a date picker to this product. So the first thing I'm going to do is go to the Shopify app store and download our Dato Date Picker Pick a Date app. And as soon as you have installed it, you can simply click on our app. App dashboard will open up. Here you will also find instruction video how to set it up on 2.0 and 1.0 themes. But I will now show to you how this will work out. So you can choose between where you want to show your uh, date picker, for example, on the product page or even also possible on the card page. But um, you have to imagine that on card page you can just add one date picker and you can set multiple date pickers to different product pages. So let's click here on product page and now you can simply follow the instruction guidelines. For example, first of all, you can give here a, enter here a unique date picker field name. On the right side, you always see the, um, the live preview of the date picker, how you, it will be added into your store. Then here you see some custom translations, but in my case, English will be fine. So we can simply click next. We have two different styles of the a date picker design. So first of all, we have this kind of design. As soon as you will click inside, the date picker will open up or you have the opportunity di to directly show a calendar. So then you have different kind of possibilities to change the, yes, the color, the, the text and all the, that kind of things. But in my case, I think we can simply leave it in this black color, for example, click the next button. We can on, uh, also enable times for selection. I think this is very important if you want to allow some time slots. We have American and European time format. In my case, American will be also fine. You can set exact time slots, then they can choose an exact time. But I recommend if you want to make something like store pickup to allow different kind of time slots, for example, pick a time, then we can set maybe from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. the first time slot we want to set and I have daily just five of these slots available so I will enter five click add and then you see here five slots from 9 to 10 a.m. are available you can add multiple time slots but in my case I will just allow one time slot click next I'm available from Monday to Friday so I simply take Saturday and Sunday off so then you can also see Saturday and Sunday gets always blocked so that no one can choose on this date. You can also enable opportunity between local delivery and store pickup. So this is also possibility, but in my case, it will be fine if we just go with the standard date picker with some time slots and I need some order preparation time here. Maybe let's say five days is the first available date they can choose from. So this is also very good if you don't want that they can directly choose a date maybe already tomorrow or in the same day so they can now just if you set here for example five they can just choose dates in five days okay click next then i can also disable some further dates for example i'm also not available on 28th of february click here this dates get simply disabled then we can click next by default, it will be shown on all products and all variants. If those things are selected, in my case, this will be fine. Simply hit the save button. Field gets generated. And now very important for the Shopify 2.0 themes, the new Shopify themes, that you also go to your online store. Go to customize. Choose the product where you want to display the date picker. In some cases, it's already shown but it's always important that you will add this kind of um, app block to it so that it will be shown right on all the different devices and themes. So in my case, I have already selected it and added it here so I can simply hold it clicked and can also move the position. If you haven't added yet, you can simply go here and find the add block here, click on it, and then you will find here the date picker app and then the app block will be added and will look like this and then you can simply 
change the position also when you hold it clicked. Yes, this is it. This is how you can, how easy you can insert a date picker to your product.